Hi everyone, hi guys, and welcome back to my YouTube channel. Guys, it has been way too long. It has been way too long, and I'm not even gonna keep this, I'm gonna keep this video very brief. We're gonna get straight into it. Hi, hello, if you don't know who I am, I am a final year architecture student, Christian, born again believer, unapologetic born again believer, and welcome to my channel, guys. Welcome to my world i'm joking welcome guys welcome 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 thank you all thank you all who have stayed subscribed i don't know what to because the content hasn't really been contenting heart you guys so much for those that stayed subscribed that you know believed in your girl that your girl would come back and she is finally back i feel like i've sat down and done these oh my gosh i'm back 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 videos over and over again but yeah you shall know them by their fruits believe me not by the things that i say but by the things that i do okay i owe you guys a little bit just a little bit of an explanation i went away for about six months you know few life updates few life updates you know don't worry i'm not like you know i don't have a child or like married or anything like that i'm still you know in university um grinding but yeah just a few life updates just a few things that i thought i'd update you guys with with before i like just kind of delve into you know back to uploading uh but yeah that's what this video is here for if you have stayed subscribed if you're new to my channel hi hello my name is nana do subscribe do subscribe do subscribe what have i been up to okay i would say that i've probably been away for a lot longer than six months you know like even when i was uploading those videos towards the end of like my hiatus he end of my hiatus the beginning of my hiatus i was already gone like i just youtube really wasn't the space you know youtube wasn't really the vibe for your girl um so yeah kind of leading up to obviously um i kind of fell off of youtube mainly because content wise i didn't know really i didn't really know what direction or what i wanted to create anymore second of all my camera broke when i first moved into this apartment so yeah and i obviously you know your girl is the advocate of oh my gosh you can film with your phone oh my gosh da, 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 you know da, 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 da. but it was hard like being able to film on a, on a vlog camera and then going back to an iphone and transfer this that it would be petty excuse but it's the truth okay on top of that like i said i didn't really know what to film anymore i was kind of rebranding i was kind of you know you know i wasn't your first year nana in uni filming kitchen videos anymore with a friendship group of 20 people i was starting to kind of trying to rebrand in the middle of rebranding but not pausing to come out of what i do, do you know what i mean and kind of like on top of that i was actually like you know growing as a believer hi hello if you're new here i am a born again unapologetic believer and follower of jesus christ so it was like okay i want to kind of push faith onto my channel as well and see how that all fits and it was just there was a lot going on like trying to figure it out while still uploading and i wasn't really enjoying the videos that i was creating um if you actually go on my channel i've actually privated a lot a lot of videos like a lot of videos like i'm li i think i'm like down to like 90 something videos bear in mind in total i think i have over like 250 I, you guys have been doing this for a long time okay i did not just come to uni and start and did oh hi hello welcome back to my youtube channel on kitchen countertop no your girl has been doing this for a while um so this rebrand was really kind of reintroducing me i knew i needed the time to kind of just step back rethink recreate and know what i wanted to do obviously i've entered into final year guys final year architecture final year architecture <laughs> baby there's a lot of things a lot of things but there's going to be so much content so much content because you know funnily enough this kind of hiatus kind of rebrand i was going to wait until i graduated yeah but then i realized there's so much that you guys can kind of learn there's so much that i can kind of give in these last kind of moments of my undergraduate degree as an architecture student so why would i wait until like when i graduate do you get it i want to kind of bring you guys along with the all night study sessions and the deadlines and the model making and all of that stuff and i know that's kind of the content that really kind of pushed me in first year kind of just being a real university student at ntu uh, obviously i'm in final year i'm a final year architecture student at not Trent university obviously like i said i'm a believer i'm born again like yeah i was building and growing in 
my faith as well you know navigating faith as a believer but me i'm just i'm i'm just glad that my brand is caris like do you get it like i love my church i love that i'm i'm i like i'm in the best church personally i'm in the best church ciao um and i just love i love the growth there's still so much more growing to do, but I love the growth. When I mention, or when I kind of say faith, um, added to kind of like my rebrand and stuff like that. So I think I did faith, final year faith fashion or something like that. I just did it because it was FFF, to be honest. Um, I'm not gonna sit here and, you know, be like, hi, how to study your Bible. I can, I can leave you a link to a message <laughs> by my head pastor, the best, Reverend Dr. David Edgy. I can leave you a message link down below, but, I am definitely gonna incorporate more of like the things that I do in terms of like church and stuff like that. I feel like I've mentioned it by Vibratum. You guys will hear it in the background. I'm listening to messages and stuff like that and I'll mention it. But I think we're gonna really, really include it this time round, okay? Um, so the, you guys know that it's not just like a section of my life. It's my life, do you get it? It's not, it's not God, family, friends or God, family, career. It's God, okay? <laughs> That's it. Um, seek ye first the kingdom of God and his righteousness and all things shall be added unto you. Your girl turned 22. Yeah, that's, that's, that's like, that. yeah, that's, yeah. Your girl turned 22. You guys have seen me on the YouTube channel since I was like, what, 14, 15? Something like that, something crazy like that. I'm 22 years of age. I'm still a pedestrian, but I'm 22 years of age. What does that mean? I still don't have my driver's license, but by fire, by force. This summer, guys, yeah, driving lessons, theory test coming up very soon, driving lessons pending. Yeah, it's all happening. Yeah, because this year it smells, it it literally smells of Nana on the roads and I cannot wait to bring you guys along with me with that. Um, so yeah, turn 22, very grateful to God for turning 22, seeing 22. 22nd birthday with my friends, my loved ones, we kind of like had Chinese celebrated my birthday got my standard pics as usual i went very casual this year for my 22nd birthday like in terms of like my dressing like it was just kind of like smart cash you know 22 yeah but yeah glory be to god turned 22 um what i've also been up to is kind of looking at postgraduate plans guys again oh, like a video is gonna come a video is really gonna come about all of that if I am going to be continuing my master's in Nottingham, if I am going to continue my master's, what that's going to look like. Yeah, we need, we need a talk. We need a, you know, I don't even know if architecture is the route that I want to go down anymore, but we will talk about it. That was kind of section one. I've done, I finished section one. Uh, guys, I finished section one and it says 11 minutes on the camera. So my creative rut. Now, if you have been on this platform, be it YouTube, Instagram, TikTok, whatever it is. Listen, if you are creative, you go and go for a creative rut. And mine slapped me straight in the face. I've kind of touched on it where obviously I didn't really have the equipment um, in terms of like my vlogging camera broke, getting it fixed was just a joke. Saving up for a new one is just a joke. You know, I'm a student. I'm not working like the way I used to work back in sixth form when I had like two jobs. I was working like 30 hours a week. So yeah i mean your girl is obviously still on the hunt for um a, ca a camera i do want to get the canon g set 7x and is actively looking um for it i don't actually not mind buying it brand new like it's not that like, deep like it's on marketplace i don't mind um but alongside that creative rut i definitely contemplated deleting my youtube channel like not contemplating i was pretty much about to press the button yeah 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 it was that bad um yeah i was very much like on the verge of just saying you know what you've been fun <laughs> you okay okay you've been a moment a season you've had your time yeah i was very much like mm, it's not that deep there's other critters like they're out there like me they ain't gonna miss me too much but i think one of the things that really stuck with me was a probably the fact that i was still meeting a lot of you guys like on campus in town like in the city of nottingham um and a lot of you used to like a lot of you would say oh my gosh i still watch your youtube videos or oh my gosh i i like coming to nottingham trying you like you really helped me look for this accommodation with this that and the other and knowing like obviously i i see it you know on social media but like then seeing it in person it's like it's unmatched like 
somebody actually coming up to you be like oh my gosh i recognize you um usually it's when i'm at evangelism to be honest um one thing you will catch me doing on campus is evangelizing and yeah when i'm at evangelism usually people will be like wait a minute i recognize you and i'm like where and they're like youtube and i was like yeah yeah like a creative rock and like obviously a lot of my friends would be like oh my gosh just jump back on youtube just jump back on youtube there's no way that's the time on. a lot of my friends would just be like yeah just jump back on youtube just jump back on youtube with mission on youtube but it's not that easy like hi hi my fellow creators my fellow you know people on social media platforms or just in whatever you guys know, you guys know what it is. Like, especially the way that the YouTube game is. People are in their bag. People are doing their thing. Um, even so much where I actually kind of, I like, I actually genuinely stopped watching YouTube because I don't watch normal TV. Um, when I do watch YouTube, I'm listening to messages. Um, and if I do do watch YouTube, it's very specific YouTubers I watch that I know is not gonna like contaminate or like, not you know as a believer there's just some things i shouldn't give my eyes to do you know what i mean there's very specific youtubers that i do watch when i do watch them and i i, I just i stopped watching youtube like i just i stopped watching like my subscription box i like i had like a catch up like maybe two weeks ago but it was like yeah i just thought i stopped watching youtube guys like so on top of the creative run i wasn't watching youtube i wasn't really inspired or motivated you know motivated to come back on youtube either so it was like Mm, might as well delete it like the channel was there my views weren't banging as as they used to my likes weren't banging as they used to i've even gone down in subscriber you know thank god um in all things we give thanks it's just like mm, she served her time i've had my fun mm. in 10 years time at 32 years of age doing husband tag with my husband and kids like baby no it's <laughs> just not gonna happen but as of right now where i'm still very young um i still again have a lot to like give or show of my life like i guess um why not still record it like i and you know the gag actually is is that this thing is so innate in me like it like filming and documenting things it's so much in me that even over the course of when i wasn't filming when i wasn't vlogging when i didn't even have the urge or like want to kind of pick up the camera and film and do anything i was still filming and recording that's why you, you see like all these little like little little clips because i was still kind of doing what i just usually do but just not uploading it um and i really enjoyed that like i really enjoyed that um but it goes back it goes back i mean that's the truth of it all i was on the verge of deleting my youtube channel i basically was about to click delete um but yeah i don't want to be all speaking be like oh my gosh i heard a voice from god yeah she's gonna grow old get married have kids and yeah <laughs> it won't just be just none anymore it'll be just none our husband and our kids so you know and let me she feel that she's <laughs> my mom got me a macbook i don't know why I, I, that took me so long my mom got me a macbook basically because my old macbook was broken um i had the, i bought my first macbook i actually did an unboxing i think on this channel um and if you guys would like to see a macbook unboxing then let me know down below um let me get get it for you Eey, she's heavy yeah Oh, she's really heavy actually filming at the time it was like i don't have anything to film this for so it's not that deep let me just open it um but then i was like mm, i might be coming back so let me not actually fully open it but here she is she got me a macbook um thank you mom it's a macbook air so something new um and it is the m2 chip 13 inch macbook air 256 gigabyte um 16 gb un uh, yeah memory yeah this is she um and i think this is the one with the new the new port like the bigger port like you know the port that's like huge so yeah she got me a macbook guys like that's big i didn't even know she was actually getting it for me like i'll be so honest with you she literally just i think one of the days i, I went home for a weekend and she was like oh my gosh going to this section of my room da, 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 da. um surprise <laughs> i guess Investing back in me again, investing in my content. I've been on the hunt for a Canon G7X Mark II, Mark III, whatever. I know people say the Sony ZV-1, is, but yeah, I'm, I'm a Canon babe. Like, I'm just a Canon babe. Point blank, period. If you guys know anybody that's selling one or some anybody who's like selling it, not for a dumb price, okay? Okay, thank you very much. But I am back in, into investing in me. Um, what does that mean? As I was obviously preparing for this, I've literally got like 
a month's worth of content ready to film and be scheduled even the video after this is going up on wednesday the 20th and it's going to be like a busy week in my life i filmed like almost what felt like the most busiest week in my life every single day i was doing something wednesday and on sunday we have a video all about finding your architecture and then content after that and content after that so do you guys do you guys do you guys you guys do let me know what you guys genuinely genuinely want to see i don't know why those words were not coming out of my mouth when i knew i wanted to come back to youtube i said it's time to invest in me again and whatever that means whether that's my content being really dope i was gonna actually wait until i was able to buy myself a camera and actually like come back with a camera but i was like why wait like guys i started my youtube channel on my iphone 6 5s my iphone 5s yeah i was editing on imovie up until maybe 2021 2020 2022 it was second year uni that's when i started editing on imovie I can even, I remember the first video I edited on iMovie. It's my finals week video. Yeah. So I'm gonna try and keep it top quality, you know, excellence, baby. Yeah, because <clears throat> the one thing I realized, especially as I was like entering into my creative rut, was that the excellence on my channel completely dropped. Like it just, it. Um, and I didn't like what I was putting out. I wasn't even watching what I was putting out. So how much more others? Channel growth. Okay, so I knew that coming back to YouTube, okay, let me just rip the, the plaster off the bandage. You grow up, Just Anna's life is going, okay? It has to go. Like I can't facilitate two channels at the same time, especially where I'm only now falling back in love with the first one. Um, just Nana includes just my life as well. So I don't know why I separated the two. Um, I understood at the time, at the time everybody was doing it, you know, Just Nana's live, Just Nana. Um, loads of people were doing it. Like they would have a main channel and they'll have a vlog channel. They have a main channel and a vlog channel. But I feel like cause now everything is just kind of pick up the camera and go. There's no need. Cause there's not like that need of, okay. Sometimes you might get a sit down chit chat video. Sometimes you might get a vlog. Sometimes you might get, do you get it? And I feel like Just Nana will just encompass all of it. So. The channel is going. I'm not deleting anything off of it. Uh, I mean, a few videos had to get private, chat. Um, Cause you know, doing this life in Christ, baby. I think it's just gonna stay there. And I'm just gonna leave it like that. Yeah, I don't know, who knows? Maybe in the future I might change it into something else. But as of now, as we speak, the channel is, it's dormant. Like I'm not gonna be uploading on there. Um, all my vlogs and stuff like that will be going up on here. And I feel like it will definitely like, channel in more engagement and more growth on this channel you know like 18.6 thousand people once i'm consistent once i'm, I'm back in the swing of uploading i'm sure that's when you know the, the subscribers will come back you know the subscribers will resurrect the numbers will hear me again okay but do tell a friend to tell a friend that nana is back it does help it does help a lot liking this video does help a lot subscribing turning on my bell notification does help a lot and even dropping a little cheeky comment helps a billion oh so, you guys are probably thinking now i'm back what is my uploading schedule going to be like you know yada 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 and i know you've said so many times you're back you're going to be consistent you're going to be this you're going to be that are you just saying it because it's the new year i mean maybe we are three months into the new year you know i mean if i really wanted to come back i probably should have come back the first of jan uploading schedule as of right now is going to be once a week maybe twice a week i think in the upcoming weeks depending on because of the content that I need to get out in the set time frame that I want to get it out in, some weeks is going to be twice a week, but as in touchdown, what I've committed myself to is once a week. 7 p.m. every Sunday. Let me know if that works for you guys. I think it's the best time that works for me because I think what I'm going to do is actually, if I'm filming a sit down video, film it every Saturday morning um, and then yeah because the way that final year is the way that final year is i literally my monday to friday is more than a nine to five it's like a nine to eight pm so i cannot like throughout the week i li i can't commit anything to youtube like in terms of filming editing da -da -da, unless it's like a vlog style video my exam season and assignment season is coming up very very soon so there might be weeks i might miss but don't hit don't, don't 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 throw stones for don't don't, don't come, you know don't come and crucify me for it what i probably will do is actually like the community tab so i'll keep you guys posted on the community tab whenever videos coming out this that and the other 
um so you guys kind of can keep your eyes peeled um i feel like that will really work in terms of communication as to when a video is coming when a video is not my channel direction like like you guys have seen you know i've kind of changed my intro not like obviously the <laughs> Yeah, that's just Nana. But I, I would even try and trademark it if I could. But like my, yeah, that had to go. I was speaking to my friend um, the other day and she was like, I tried to tell you, I suggested this like two years ago, but you just said, no, it's an original. Blah, 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 blah. Yeah, I don't know how, how you guys are watching that marble. I remember when I first made that, I made that on Fonto or Vont. Like, OG YouTubers would know those apps and yeah, I made that on Fonto and Vont. I made it, I, it was like a revolution. It was like, yeah, like, yeah, clear, gone, clear. It's all very simple. I am, you know, open to changing it, but that was just something that I made quickly on Canva and I kind of like it, you know, the white, the black, the fave final fashion year. It's making a lot of sense. Introducing myself, you know, the 22 Nana, the final year Nana, the woman that she's becoming there's a lot in store there's a lot in store for this channel direction there's a lot in store that this channel i want to capture and kind of document and i cannot wait for you guys to see it and just to finish off this video is actually just what do you guys want to see from me what what do you the viewer you know you've seen like kind of like accommodation room tours what do you guys want to see from me and be for real okay be for real because like i said i'm not going to be ordering the person of what the person orders in front of like no the live stuff you guys will come along see me finish my undergraduate degree you guys are going to see me graduate in jesus name i will graduate see what i get up to you guys are really gonna see just nana i'm so happy to be back even filming this i was a bit like mm -hmm. the fact that i had to basically script this whole like video just get straight into it you know not looking at numbers or anything like that but do subscribe because it helps you go out and i'm really gonna put my heart and soul back into this thing i realized that when i was going full speed like when i was treating this thing like a full-time job even though it wasn't like a full-time paycheck that's when I was seeing increase, I was seeing growth, I was seeing new faces, I was seeing creative ideas come to me and I just kind of want to get back to that space where I was going full speed. Um, final year in itself is, you can't like, final year you cannot take the gas off, you cannot take your foot off the gas. Me adding YouTube into the mix is just like, are you okay? Are you like actually okay? But I think it's doable, I think it's possible, I think I'm going to document my life, you're gonna, you guys are going to see Just Nana and I hope you are subscribed for the journey so hi hello and this was like my first video ever back on my channel i don't know hi hello if you're not subscribed if you're new here make sure you are subscribed switch on the bell notifications and thank you so much for watching this video if you did enjoy give it a big thumbs up you're gonna enjoy this channel so just give it a big thumbs up ahead of time anyways video will be out in three days yeah three days holding myself to account here have a blessed day i hope you had i hope you had a blessed day i hope you're having a blessed day and i hope you have a blessed day depending on whatever time you're watching this and by god's grace i'll see you guys on wednesday bye guys bye thank you so much for watching oh my god okay. i'm back bye guys